Good morning, guys. It's Sunday, and it's time to go fishing. So yeah, I haven't been out there in a minute. I got a lot of things going on in my life, personal life, a lot of work. Well, I haven't had a chance. And also it's been raining a lot lately, but today we're definitely taking the kayak out. I'm about to load it up in the truck and get the rods loaded. Um, making sure I don't forget anything that I need out there in the water. We're gonna get some drinks. Uh, we gotta stop at Walmart, get some worms, probably some chicken liver for the catfish. And uh, we gotta get the coffee, so we got a lot of things to do before we get to the water, so let's get going, guys. Alright guys, so we're here already. You guys can see we're gonna catch some bait. Need a couple bluegills. I got all the baits. I brought some corn. I got chicken liver, but I wanna have at least one or two bluegills that I can that I can use as bait. So just busting the little rod out and just hitting the bank right here. We're gonna catch some bait. That's some bait. That's a decent sized bait. All right, first bait of the day. Good size. Good size. You golfed it. All right, guys, so we made it to the spot. Uh, it's a lot of traffic today, a lot of boat traffic. So not sure how this is going to go, but we're going to definitely try. Give it a good try. I have been struggling all morning. I'm here a little bit later than I wanted to be. And I also don't have a lot of bluegills. I only got one bluegill. I'm going to be trying to cast and uh, catch some more bluegill eventually here. But right now, I need to set up for the for the for the catfish which uh, hopefully can catch some catfish there's a big hole right here super deep hole uh it's the ledge right here so we're gonna be casting straight into that hole hopefully there's some catfish just sitting down there in the bottom and uh we, we even probably gonna try to catch uh, a bluegill or something here but definitely i think i feel really confident about this spot we'll see what happens all right so let's get uh some baits in the water like I said guys, we got a bunch of different baits today. Got some chicken liver right there, as you can see. I brought some corn. I brought some uh, worms. And I brought some corn. I brought worms. And I brought, we've got one bluegill in here. So we're gonna start with this rod right here. And we're gonna be doing next. We're gonna be setting up with the chicken liver to see how that goes. The wind is gonna be pushing me all day today. 
okay so again guys using a circle hook for this catfish this chicken liver right there this chicken liver it's good for fishing but it's so messy i still haven't got uh the magic thread that i want to get I'm gonna get that magic thread so the chicken limb doesn't fall off that easy off the hook. But here goes first rod right here. See if we catch anything with it. I'm gonna be using the head part with this bluegill. Just hook it on the top. For some reason lately I've been having a lot of luck with the heads. So hook it from the top. Make sure there's no scales on your hook. There you go. Now this rod right here, I'm gonna put some corn on. So, I'm going to grab some of this corn. Toss it right there. First fish. Oh, it feels good. All right. Yeah. First catfish of the day. I totally was not paying attention. It's coming up real fast. Oh, he saw the boat, I think. Still fighting me. Oh, what is it? This is not this might not be a catfish. Oh yeah, it is a catfish. Get inside right here. Try and net this fish. Oh, he didn't want to get netted. There we go. All right. First fish of the day. Good, nice chatter cat. That catfish was cut on the head of the bluegill. Alright. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, he got my net. Oh, no. That's no bueno. He got the net and everything. Oh, he got, he got a hook on the bottom lip. And then he got the net. Let's go. All right, guys. First fish of the day. Just a channel cat. Oh, Lord. Relax. I forgot how to drop it. I'm going to get stung. All right, guys. First fish of the day. That's a nice, decent sized channel catfish. Good, good eating size right there. I don't know if I'm gonna keep any fish today. I don't think so. I don't got time to uh, cook him. But if you guys wanna see a uh, catch and cook, just let me know, and I do that for you guys. This actually tastes delicious. Uh, this I will eat this fish. Honestly, if I had a lot of time today, but I got 
I gotta go to the family today. I got a family thing going on. So I won't be able to cook him today and it's best to cook him fresh, all right? So we're gonna have release this one. This is the first decent fish of the day. Uh, right when I expected to find him, right in that hole. It's like a 45 uh, feet drop right there. And then that's what I'm targeting. So on these summer days when it's really hot, you wanna target the really deep spots uh especially if it's at a big drop off before that so they just sit in there in the bottom chilling so go ahead and release this fish it's bleeding a little bit but he'll be all right all right so here you go guys first fish of the day fast they can go so you want to be careful with them okay that's the main thing the main danger is being out here not you flipping not you drowning is getting hit by one of those all right guys so we're getting bites right here this rod is getting bites fish we might have a fish Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yo, you see this fish? Look at this fish. fish I have ever caught as a catfish goes so you guys can see this fish is tiny it is really really tiny all right so you have to be careful with this little fish I don't even know how they ate that hook it's so soft, it's a baby. Are you really kidding me? Are you kidding me? Look at this fish. That's a baby catfish. That's a really, really tiny catfish. All right, so here it goes. I had a really big bait on that fish. I don't understand how a fish that small can eat that huge bait that I had on that fish. Oh my God. But I mean, at least it's been five minutes since I drop it. And uh, I don't understand it. I don't get it. You guys saw it here. I'm the dink master. It was cool to catch a baby one. Pretty nice to see, but uh, either way, it's just a small fish. So we're gonna try it again. I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna put a piece of bluegill and a piece of chicken liver and see how it does wow all right guys unfortunately i didn't catch that many fish on that trip uh i only caught that big catfish and that small little one that was so tiny but it is what it is sometimes you be like that guy sometimes uh you go out there put the effort and uh, it doesn't pay off but it's still fishing it nevertheless so so you just gotta enjoy fishing either 
you know, if you catch fish or not. At the end of the day, the adventure is what matters. But for the second part of this video, I'm ahead and show you guys a little outing that I did to a local uh, pond. I uh, was catfishing as well. I caught a couple decent catfish. Uh, hope you enjoyed that. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. And don't forget to hit like and comment. I want to know what you guys think. Uh, let me know what you think about the channel and your likes help more people reach the videos and makes the channel grow. So I appreciate everybody that takes the time to support me, guys. So here you go, take a look at that, and I'll see you guys on the other side. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel DMO TV. Today we are going fishing. I haven't been putting videos out lately because I've been really busy. I just have a baby boy. So we're doing the whole baby thing, but today we have a few hours so we can go fishing, but we're not gonna go far. So we're just gonna go ahead and go to the local Pay Lake and see what we can do. We got the stuff in the truck, ready to go. So let's get going, catch some fish. All right, guys, made it to the spot. It is hot as hell today. So this is our spot right here. It's really busy. We got a lot of people at the lake today. We're gonna see if we can catch anything, man. It's super sunny. We got some drinks. We gotta stay hydrated. Remember, stay hydrated. It's super hot, guys. It's extremely hot, so just gotta be careful with the heat. But hopefully, that triggers some bite. We're supposed to get some rain later on, but I'm not sure if we're gonna be getting it or not. If not, we're gonna try to wait it out, but we'll see. So let's get into uh, catching some bait first and then catching some catfish. So let's go. First one. <clears throat> we got first fish of the day, guys. First fish of the day feels good. It was a uh, for an hour or so. I'm trying to push him in. It's pulling, but I don't want to get all my lines tangled up. It's not big. But it's decent size. It's a size fish. So. First fish of the day. It's nothing crazy. It's just a good eating size, I think. one first fish of the day nothing crazy nothing big just regular eating size fish all right it's just a small fish we're gonna let him go see now he don't want to let go of my grippers goes one down hopefully many more to come I'm gonna bite we gotta bite I'm gonna bite yeah that feels like a fish all right I think we got fish number two guys <clears throat> fish number two let's go feels pretty good not fighting that much, but I'll be a little better than the other one. Swimming this way. Yeah, it's swimming towards, swimming towards me. Okay, slightly bigger. Try to keep it away from my other rods. Okay, fight a little bit. 
Oh, he got my other rod. Oh, no. Uh, I'm gonna fight him this way. Uh, yes. All right, fish number two, guys. Slightly better. Slightly better. There he is. Slightly better catfish. Oh, snap my line right there. Snap my line. There you go. Fish number two completely snapped my line. Hi right, guys, that's fish number two. Cut my line off. Uh, it's a little bigger fish, good eating size. Like I said, I'm not keeping fish today, but I'm gonna go ahead and release it. But nice fish nonetheless. There you go, fish number two, guys. Just like that. Hopefully, they start biting now. All right. You go, big boy. Ah, oh, damn it. That's nasty. Okay. Got me all wet. You got a fish, yo. Oh, that's a good one. That's big. Yeah, it feels good. That feels good right there. All right. Feels all right. He's swimming towards me though. I ain't trying to push him too much. Are you gonna freak out? There you go. It's all right. It's all right. Yeah. Uh, that yeah, it felt good. It was not that big. About three pounds. Saw one there. All right. Fish number three. Right there. Around three pounds. More pliers right here. Yeah, 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 I'll let you go. It's all right. All right, so circle hook right inside of the mouth. Fish number three. Go saw that bite. Almost missed that fish, yo. But here you go. Go. All right, guys. That's all I got for today. Uh, ended up catching, you know, three decent catfish on that trip. Um, Should have kept one to eat it. Um, I'm planning to do a catching cook coming up soon. But with that said, guys, if you like that video, uh, don't forget to subscribe, and uh, I'll be putting posting more videos just like that. Uh, let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.